Sun is trying to come out. Look at this. Oh, still have the farm truck. What's up, guys? How's it going? So we just ripped the quad. We got some freshy tires on there. We got freshy tires for days. Yeah. We got these freshy ones from Super ATV. These are 32-inch Super ATV ATV Warrior. Or AT Warrior. I just wanted to say ATV so many times. Um, we got freshy tires for the Mav or the <laughs> dirt bike. Freshy tires for the Maverick. We got these freshy steel tires for the Maverick. And we got freshy tires for the quad. So there's a lot of freshy tiring going on. Big, it's tire season. What's the plan? Go. What's the plan? Here's the plan. Pit crew action. Zoop, 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 zoop. Tire off. Steel tire on. Burn out down the road. Sink into the dirt. Zing. Is that what? Are we doing steel tires today? We're doing steel tires. I think we <laughs> I thought we were just going to change the tires today. Are we changing those? I tires? think we should try and change them. And then tomorrow, it'll still be the same video, but you're running out of time. You know what? Let's change something. Okay. Let's just change well, Let's something. start changing tires. So we're going to change the tires. Oh, we got to throw these wheel spacers on too. So um, these, were the, these were the last ones. These were an inch. New hitch too. Those are an inch. These are an inch and a half. Um... Obviously, there's no spacers on it right now, so it's kind of narrow. So it's 64. We've had it at 68 for a while because the rim's at an inch too. But now we're going 69 because it's time. Lucky number 69. Yeah, because it's Dude. hilarious. Doesn't matter which way you uh, it, 69. <laughs> All right, let's throw that door down and uh, start tiring away. I think that was traveling. I think we need to contact the jack company. <laughs> What's wrong with my, my tractor jack? There's nothing wrong with it. We just need like a quick pit crew check. <laughs> we need an air jack. Air tools ever. Look at this. Look at the travel on that thing, eh? We up. We're up. All right. We're there. How do you take these off? Do you remember how? What do you want to know? Ugh, I want to know. There's four bolts. Why well, I don't have knee pads on these things. I got knee pads somewhere. Pretty sure you have insert area pockets for them. Yeah. Oh, there are my work pants. Over there. There they are. Alright. Take them off. Ready for this? Quick. Everyone? Quick as you can do it. Quick as I can do it? Yeah. I don't think you can do it faster than seven seconds. Wait. Hold on. Okay. Wait. Wait. Here we go. Go. This is embarrassing. This is embarrassing. What is going on here? Oh my god. Good job, man. Yeah. I thought I thought you might have it at like eight or nine, but I screwed up. The one didn't come off all the way. That was embarrassing. Look at the mud in there. Alright. One tire down. One down. Broke a nail. <laughs> Broken nail. Broken nail. Oh yeah, not too bad. Good. Right? New tires everywhere. Uh, this place smells like robber in here. There's yeah. so many new tires. It smells like your bedroom. Four seconds. <laughs> First one was a practice. Yeah, yeah, that was four. Next one will be three. Ugh. Got nuts everywhere. Yeah. Just like your bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Hey! All right. All right. All right. All right. Now. We need. So. I'll take the beads off. If you guys haven't used wheel spacers before. I've been using them for a while. I had them on my Renegade way back when. Uh, now I have them on this. It's an easy way to make it a little wider. And uh, yeah, I don't know, it's cheaper. Let's see them on there. Let's see them on there. Be the shiniest. Let's see them on there. Installed. They're on. How's your day? Look it out. Oh, look how much better that looks, eh? Not too bad. Not too bad. <laughs> All right. All right, let's go swap some tires. Let's do it. Getting those beads off. 
Just took all the nuts off the spacers. I'll throw those on in a second. Get your ring off. These are metal rings. A little mud to the face there. Oh, you like in the face, eh? Ah, a little. Whoa. <laughs> Look at all the mud underneath. We'll definitely need to, we'll have to clean those off, that's for sure. Come as you go. Get them make, clean off there. Make them a little wider, eh? Yeah. Make sure you weigh up. Line your hole up. There you yeah, go. Ugh, yeah, you go on pretty simple. I say that now, but I'm just kidding. You torquing on. these on? Yeah. Got my. I'm actually torquing them yeah, on. Yeah, you are. Side. Not like the claws. This is a real install and, here. And torquing these little guys. Chill, bam. Get in there. Yeah, wheel spacers are nice. I don't know, I just, I like them. Make it a little wider. Brings things out too, so it's easier to pressure wash your brakes. Whatnot, if you ever clean your machine. If you don't, you know, it's your life, we just live it. You might get a little, you might get, be a little tight in Muskoka this year. <laughs> a couple of those areas, eh? Well, I'm only one inch bigger. So. An, oh. an inch is a lot if you don't have it. Never had an issue with tight spaces there. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, get her on there. Get her Come in on, there. Girl. Take oh, your time. Too tight. Hold on. Got excited. There we go. They make it just big enough for the socket. Yeah, they do. That's torques, right? You're good. You're good. We're on the old here and wait. There it is. You're there. There it is. Right. And Bang, bango. And how's your day? Bango. Short. We're good. Spacers on. <sighs> Let's go wash these tires off and put some freshies on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Clean up. Get all your Look like brand new ribs. Uh oh, we run out of steam. There we go. Flip it over. Brand new. Yeah, gee, look at this. What was rubbing on the inside of this one? So, on the Mavericks, there's a there's a mud clearing guard yeah. on the rear tires. But, it's the dumbest thing. But it rubs on that one, but not this one. That's a front tire. It doesn't have it. We took this. I, I swapped them recently. Oh, did you? Yeah, remember we switched them. So, as soon as you get gravel or anything in there, it yeah. gets caught in between and it just takes the coating right off. But yeah, look at this one. It's perfectly Yeah, fine. that's crazy. <laughs> crazy, eh? So, it's a dumb idea, but uh, whatever. What can you do? All right, let's pop these off the bead. Let's go. Look at these guys. What are they up to over there? Never know what they're up to. Just come and check us out. Oh, the one's pushing the other one around. They're beating each other up. We got a little bit of a scuffle. <laughs> let's see. Right. We're going to witness something here. And nothing's happening. They're good. We're back. You coming right out? You want, you want me to bring the tire right there? All right, all right. You're dumping it? Oh, look at that soup.
her down a little more. There you go. There we go. She's off. And that, folks, is the best way to uh, pop her off the bead. That's it. Oh. oh, look at you, eh? The old pro, eh? The old pro. Starts with the ATV tires. Now we're just a pro at this side by side there. What am I doing? I got the wrong thing. Yeah, you're piling up the rims over there. A couple rim jobs. All right, let's uh, slap those bad boys on. Let's see your record for putting the rim in. Mine was half a second. These are a little easier than the quad ones. Other way. Other way. Face down, yeah. <laughs> That? So much easier, right? <laughs> uh, all right, let's uh, we'll throw the bolts in there. Get her mounted. So much fun, eh? One screw. One screw. Uh, bolt. Bolt. Uh, bolt. <laughs> Sounds even better. Get them torqued in there. Ready? Get her popped. There we go. Whew. That was fun. Yeah. Almost there. Oh. Three, two, one. Would've been so sweet. That works out one of these days. What do we got? That's good. I think it popped on. Yeah, good enough. Good enough? She'll pop herself on eventually. All right, get a air out of it now? Uh, yeah. Whew. One more. She's snowing out there. Just lately. Oh yeah, get her on there. Oh yeah. Ugh. There you go. There we go. Couple other ones. Bango, bango. Bango, bango. Got the fancy little unit with that unit. Slapped on this unit. Slamming off. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> Ugh. There we go. There we go. Bango, bango. Go, bango. One on here. There you go. Double team it. Shabam. You're an old pro at changing oh, tires now, eh? Oh, yeah. Next, we change tracks. <laughs> Next, we get the other shredder back and fix the wiring. I know. Oh, Papa McKechnie's gonna come out. He doesn't know yet, but <laughs> he know yet, it's coming out. We're gonna fix her up. That's it, that's all. Torqued, eh? Oh, yeah. I guess I can torque it if you really want me to. Well, you should do it properly. Okay, Dad. <laughs> hey, she looks, oh, I like it better. Like it better, right? Yeah. Oh. Shabam! Click! How's your day? Chicken noodle soup. Got it. Alright. That's it. We'll continue this video tomorrow. Well, I'm gonna put the other one. You leave, and then I'll let it down and show people what it Perfect. Alright. Right. Approved. See ya. See you tomorrow. And the new tires are on the back. That bit down. Shabam. What do you guys think? Freshy 32s, those are old 32s. These things are gonna rip some donuts mad. I do like these tires, they're aggressive, but I find for how I like to ride, there's too much of an edge. These ones are more round. They're kind of like the chicanes that I had before. So I like doing a lot of donuts. These are not good for donuts. Those are more for like rock climbing and stuff. So anyways, we'll continue this on tomorrow when Brad gets back, we'll change the front tires, go for a rip, and then maybe put the uh, steel plates on wherever they want. Oh, those things. See how she goes. We'll see you tomorrow. All right, we're back. So we got the freshies on the back the other day, then we lost Brad. We received Jay though. Dag. Dag, <laughs> he's in. So these were the old rear tires. And as you can see, they are pretty worn. Um, you know, this thing, she only spins tires, so obviously. They lasted a good year, though. So we're gonna stud these ones for next year? Yeah. Or yeah. for the spring? Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, so we're gonna save these. I sell my stock rims. We're gonna try and stud them, see where we end up. But yeah, we'll, we'll pop these off, head to the barn, and then uh, 
take this thing for a rip. And then later, next video, I'm thinking steel tires or propane tires. We haven't decided yet. Propanes might take a little longer to yeah. build, but... We're going to see how long the propane tanks today. We have all the material for the propane tanks. So. I believe so. Maybe we'll put the mini tires on. We'll see. See if there's time. We got all day. Something. Round two. Get those, get those rings off. Whoa! <laughs> it's got a bunch of different air bladders in there, apparently. Should I have my safety glasses on? Yeah. Oh, they're gonna look good. You told me there's no air in these ones. <laughs> there's the freshy spacers from Super ATV, inch and a half, half inch bigger because we're making her 69. <laughs> All right, show Brad how much better you are pulling rims out than he is. Show sure, him. Just like that. <laughs> Come on, Brad. Just like that. You know what? It's not my first time. <laughs> not the first rodeo. Definitely a lot easier putting the new rims in. Quick loop. <laughs> Don't worry about scratching the rims. <laughs> I think they're scratched already. Boom. Done. Bob Drunkle. Uncle Bob! It's air time. Is it going? I think so. Yeah. Pop. These ones don't pop, they're too new. Yeah. It's gonna slide on there. Slide it in. Looks really good with the spacers. Oh, yeah. Fresh spacers, fresh tires. What else we got coming? We got a, we got the shocker pipe coming for this thing. We got the launch control. I have the launch control. I just haven't put it on. Uh, we got the hitch over there. All the mods. You pulling some trailers soon? Yeah, yeah. So let's get these things on and uh, head down the track. We'll go rip through the snow. I wonder if this thing has gas in it. Let me check tomorrow. Also, I apologize for it being dirty. The last few times I ripped it, it was like minus 10, 15 out. So. Figured there's no point in washing it, just freeze right to it. Yeah, yeah. So we'll wash. been dirty for months, so. Yeah, we'll wash it today. Yeah. And then we'll uh, start doing some projects. <laughs> Other things. <laughs> Other things. Time to start her up and take it for a little spin. Woo, look at those lights. Oh, they're sweet. Oh, we got tons of fuel. We're good to go. Well, that's today. Right. That's why. <laughs> All right, check out these new tires. Oh yeah. Man, it looks normal again, really. I like it better again. I don't know, I like those other tires, but they're not my style. I feel like these are more my style. The speed, you know, enduro style, wide open, trail ride. So, I mean, I like Nick's machine. Stuff, but you can only ride it in certain places. Like, imagine me ripping something like when this was 40s and the 60s <laughs> around here. This doesn't make sense. Look at all the rubber from the burnout. Oh, yeah. Whoops. That'll wash away. Go tell dad. Yeah. Um, Sweet. All right. Yeah, let's head down the track. We'll finish this video off and then see if we can put some other custom wheels on this bad boy. Let's do it. Yeah. He's in there somewhere. I think he likes those new tires.
slides better. Yeah, like you see how I'm turning and it's not rolling. Yeah. The other ones are great, but they're more for like rock crawling. Like they have a really hard edge, so like when I'm cranking it completely, you know, wide open sideways, it was giving me a lot of body roll. And for my driving style, I'd prefer, you know, to be able to drift and not feel like I'm gonna flip over. So. Yeah. Oh yeah. I love these tires already, so let's head to the back and uh, get a few shots and we'll get out of here. Sweet. I can't believe the snow. It's been raining and 5, 10 degrees all week, and then you know it's like, nope, back to winter again. 11 degrees tomorrow, though. <laughs> wow. Anyways, these new tires work good. They uh, they float a lot better, I find. Oh, yeah. Instead of digging in. I'm not a digging in guy, I'm a floater. High speed floater. Yeah, high and let her fly. So let's go give this thing a wash for the first time in two months, and uh, we'll wrap up this video and start the freshie. Quick wash, I can't believe how much it is coming down. Holy, it's supposed to be 10 degrees and sunny all week. Yes. Yeah, well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We just wanted to get some fresh tires on there, go for a little rip. I'm glad to have those tires back on. Well, not back on, but that kind of style. I'm more of an enduro guy, super fast. So, anyways, thank you guys for watching. We're gonna head in the shop now and uh, try and make some propane tag wheels or some steel wheels here. We'll see how that goes. Wish, wish us luck. We'll let you know in two days in the next video. So uh, enjoy your day. 
Hope you enjoyed your weekend and uh, don't do anything we wouldn't do. We'll see you guys later.